So it's time for our final guest. She's an exotic dancer from Essex who has said that she'll have sex inside the Big Brother house. Sounds like my kind of girl. <laughs> Everyone, please welcome Bianca. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm very good. Take a seat, Bianca. Oh, let me lean on a little bit as well. Oh my God, can I sit down, time? don't crawl. I crawl. watch your show every morning. My Do mom's, you? My mum's a big fan. Okay. Can I just say Thank hi, you hi, very mom? much for so, such complimentary words over my show. Right. <laughs> Merry drunk Bianca. Hey, babe. How are you enjoying life inside the Big Brother house? Oh my God, it's amazing. I love it. I feel like I've been in here for like five, how long, like five, six weeks? Yep. I feel like I've been in here with you guys for like since right at the beginning. Just a quick fire question off the cuff. Yeah. Three people you've bonded with the most so Helen. far? Helen. I love her so much. She's like my kind of girl and like I relate to her so much within like, you know, she's been impressed, I've been impressed and stuff like that. Um, sorry. Oh my god, she's like my mum. <laughs> you know, oh, weird or cute. Yeah, no, you that's gotta be a round of applause, yeah, guys. Yeah, you always need a friend like her because it's like, you know, like someone to just, you know, whip you when you're like, you know. Slap you down when you're being bit, a bit yeah. naughty. And then, oh my god. Oh, my so, there's a few others like Mark. I love, oh my god, I just look at his face. <laughs> he makes me wet myself. <laughs> love and Christopher and. Yeah, but it's really weird because every day I think something different about someone else, you know? It's really yeah. weird and... I've got yeah. another question for you. Yeah. You said that you won't bitch behind people's backs, uh -huh. but will say it to their face. Yeah. And are there any housemates that you feel you don't say what you think to their faces? Um. Quite no. Good. Because what... The only thing that I've ever said behind someone's back it was something about Danielle. I didn't think she was being the person she is. That we remember is something what I've seen on the outside world. Right. You are a totally different person to what I see in here. I was like, whoa, like, she's totally different. On the outside world, I've seen Danielle as this horny little devil that has had, a, has had, had action. OK. Um, and... And obviously she said she's done a bit of glamour, whatever, whatever, before yep. anyway, she told me that anyway. But more wunchy than what I thought. And, yeah, I mean... And now coming into the house, what, Danielle, have you seen? You, you've obviously formulated yeah. your opinion based yeah, on... Yeah, and then watching her yeah. in here, I thought she was a prude and that she said she doesn't like this, she doesn't like that, and she's a virgin and all that. And then the outside world, she's totally opposite. So, it, would it be... But, papers do look, write a lot of Yeah. So. Would it be fair to say that if you were to label um, a housemate as maybe fake, yeah. Are you, would you attain yeah. that level I would too, say, Danielle? From me being on the outside and then me coming in here, I would say she's a fake, but she hasn't, like, she hasn't acted like she's a prude or anything. Like, since I've met her, since I've spoken to her and I tried to get to know her a bit more when I was talking to her, she hasn't... It's really weird, cos on the outside looking in to everyone, she looks like she's a prude and she doesn't like this and she doesn't like that and she's a virgin, whatever. And then when I've come in here, she's... Different. Does that make sense? Like, she doesn't act like a prude. She doesn't, you know, she, I just feel like she's just like me. Does that make sense? Not like saying like she's like a bit out there and a bit like, you know, but she's, she doesn't judge me. She hasn't judged me or anything like that. And that brings us to the end of our show. Hopefully you've learnt a lot about our new housemates. I've been your host, Stephen, and let's hear it one last time for Pav, Zoe and Bianca. Yay! Yay!